The Sandwich Assistant provides step-by-step -step instructions to help a user prepare sandwiches. It recognizes what the user has made using deep neural networks technology and suggests the next step according to a predefined recipe. In this video, we use plastic toy sandwiches to demonstrate the idea. Now find a piece of bread on the table. Now find a piece of ham on the bread. Now find a piece of lettuce on the ham. Now find a piece of bread on the lettuce. This sandwich doesn't contain any cheese. Remove the cheese and put a slice of bread on top. We have trained a neural network model for each sandwich state, including potential error states, so that we can correct a user if he makes a mistake. As you can see, our compute vision technique can accurately detect a user's progress. However, this process involves a lot of computation, so it is hard to respond to users with short delay. Our approach is to stream the images captured by glass to your cloudlet and let it do all the heavy computation. You can think of the cloudlet as a small cloud that is one wireless hub away from you. In the cloudlet that we used in the demo, there are four Intel i7 cores with hyperthread support. It has 32 gigabytes of RAM, and it uses an NVIDIA Tesla GPU for neural network processing. With all these powerful hardware, we are able to finish processing every frame in about one second. The visual and verbal guidance are then transmitted back to the glass and shown to the user. Good job, you are half done. Now put a piece of tomato on the bread. That's too much meat. Replace the ham with tomatoes. Now put the bread on top and you will be done. Congratulations, you have made a sandwich. Our system is able to work with different mobile devices while the backend on the cloud remains unchanged. Besides Google Glass, we have also tested with Microsoft HoloLens and are able to use its unique features to offer hologram feedbacks. The image on the top shows what a user sees in the real world. The bottom image displays the hologram feedback. Now put a piece of ham on the bread. As we can see, our system correctly understands what object has been placed on the table and where it is located in the 3D world. We then place the hologram model created from 3D scanning on top of the real object. When the real object moves, the system will quickly recalculate its 3D location and adjust the placement of holograms. Now put a piece of lettuce on the ham. Now put a piece of bread on the lettuce. You are half done. Now put a piece of tomato on the bread. Now put the bread on top and you will be done. The use of holograms simplifies a user's job in the task. All one needs to do is then to use the real object to match the virtual hologram object. Congratulations! You have made a sandwich.